okay hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here i am consumer debt free currently saving up for my first home and trying to pay off my undergrad school loans this is going to be my sinking fund setup but also i am doing a whole revamp of how i lay out my pages um so i'm gonna do that first with you this is an okay plans monthly planner with extra sheets in the back let me get my draft because i like drafted out how this was gonna look i just need change guys and the flow wasn't working for me anymore so i needed to change it up but let's see if i can find it um maybe not where is it I, oh it's in my new one i'm done this is my new one that i am starting for april okay here it is so this is how it's gonna go we're gonna do monthly goals here so let's look that up is it in here it is not so fail let's look in my sticker pack monthly goals These are like the old ones. No. Lord Jesus, help me. Okay, these are not it. <sighs> Where are they? Are they in my little bag? Did they fit in here? Obviously, I am a hot mess right now. But it's okay. Because I'm getting shit done. You know? They're not in here, so where could they be? My monthly goals, they have to be here somewhere. These are the old ones. Oh my god, I know where they are. They're in the back of this. <laughs> All right, I probably deleted the clip, but I was going crazy looking for this. Oh, um, God. Okay. OMG. So, monthly goals will go first. This would be my monthly goals. So, after my monthly spread, which look at these beautiful colors. We have monthly goals. Then we're going to do monthly bills, which is... From my sticker sheet we're gonna do monthly bills I just gonna remind myself okay monthly bills then we're doing um extra check on um, the next page so extra check goes here which should be one of these extra income my bad extra income okay after extra income then we're gonna do sinking funds so we're gonna do sinking funds Okay, sinking funds. After sinking funds, we're going to do paycheck breakdown. So, one, two. So, paycheck breakdown. So, basically, I'm just doing the headers with you. Um, so, I don't forget since this is going to be totally different from what I've been doing for a long time now. Ooh, I don't know. Fuck it. I mean, fudge it. <laughs> okay. Then we do another one over here. And then we're going to do Nelnet Deep Dive. Yo, if you could just see around me, it's a bloody mess. Nelnet Deep Dive. Then we're going to do Payment Plan. payment plan then we're gonna do summary 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 
summary. Summary, 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 summary. Nope, 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 right here. Summary. After summary, we're gonna do net worth. Okay, after net worth, we're gonna do reminders, which goes in the back. Reminders, and that is my new setup. So, amazing. And now we're just gonna go straight into the point of this video, which was setting up my sinking point. So, let's just figure out where I put that. Over here, okay. Sinking funds. I love sinking funds. Okay. We are going to do take out my sinking funds, which I have in this one binder. Um so we're gonna do this one first, which is fun. Beautiful. Okay, so for the fund, we're going to just go in the order of this. This one doesn't get counted, but I'll show you what I have in it. I have the $2 from Living Intentional. I have my emergency fund tracker, my home renovation. Hold on before I go out of order. Emergency fund, home renovation tracker, new house savings tracker, my puppy insurance tracker my youtube total for 2021 this is all my youtube money haven't done my taxes yet and then this is um placeholders if my sinking funds get too large because i don't like having too much cash on me so that's what i have here okay now we have amazon for amazon i'm gonna turn this a little bit to the side oh i don't wanna mess up okay for amazon i am beginning with 5065 and that is already fully stuffed okay um then we have bj's for bj's we have nothing Beginning with zero. Oh, fur baby has 20, 40, 50. So, fur baby has 50. Then we have Gerber. We have 50, 60, 70. This is due September. Groomer has, I believe, a 50. Yeah, 50. Mm, medical has, I believe, a 50 as well. Yep, 50. membership and this is for New York Sports Club is fully stuffed at 40 so 40 relationship I believe it's 490 because I'm so close for a placeholder. 1, 2, 3, 4, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90. Yep, 490. I have to talk about my boyfriend about what to do with the placeholder. Does he want half of it? And I hold half. Like, I have to figure that out. Tax lady. Because me and my boyfriend both contribute to that. Tax lady. Has 150, 170, 190. I have not done my taxes yet, but I always do my taxes late because of my lady. So it is what it is. Um, travel has 
uh, April 150, 60, 70, 170. That has 20, 40, 65. wax package has uh one hundred fifty seventy ninety what one hundred one hundred and fifty one hundred and seventy one hundred eighty YouTube taxes for twenty twenty two has a hundred and five I'm going to say U2 Texas has 105. And then Baby has Baby. I'm not pregnant, just saving for the future. 50, 70, 80 dollars. 80 bucks. My boyfriend and I both contribute to that. Holiday has, I have to take out 20 because that's from the 14th. So I'm starting off with, that's from the first. So I'm starting off with holiday. I'm starting off with how much? 110. Plus on the first, I deposited 20. So that's this one. <laughs> Okay. Oh, sugar travel too. Travel got five. No, ten. So this should actually travel. Started off with one sixty. I totally forgot. Sixty, and then I did plus ten already. Oh my God! Thank God. Because I would have just messed up my whole numbers. Okay. Holiday moving. Fake. Moving has a placeholder. So, for moving, we have 500, 600, 700, 750. So, the 500 are in the bank. 750 and then with this month I'll be able to put a thousand dollar placeholder okay so that is it for these sinking funds I also want to show you what I have you know what I'll do that at the end of this video but first let's do this I'm gonna leave a blank space just in case okay so how much am I starting off with? I am starting off with 65 plus 50 plus 70 plus 50 plus 50 plus 40 plus 490 plus 190 plus 160 plus 65 plus 180 plus 105 plus 80 plus 110 plus 750 one one ten yeah right 110 um 2450 and five omg okay now we're gonna do my bank sinking funds oh i almost wrapped up that bad boy bank sinking funds or For my bank sinking funds, we have, let's go back to March, emergency fund, I'm just going to put the short one, emergency fund of, starting off with 2,115, home essentials, I'm going to put H, 
be four thousand and five. Pup insurance. Forty-five, and then home. I put home down payment of four thousand two hundred and twenty. Okay, I'm gonna leave some space. Put it right here. So we have a total of 2115 plus 4005 plus 45 plus 4220. 10,385. Wow. Um, home essentials and home down payment are in a high yield savings account. So I don't actually have that in my checking so that it can accumulate some interest. Um... Okay, good. All right, guys. Um, the last thing I want to show you, which I'm not counting in my sinking funds, is um, my savings binder. So this is the 2000 challenge from Simple Shops. Um, I I think I leave her link down below. Her Etsy shop. She is refilling. Yeah, refilling. Is that the word? Restocking every Saturday. So definitely follow her on Instagram. So I've already done April, which I love from a month ahead. But I have these new ones. So I want to start investing. So I have this tracker here. So I just put it in membership. I want to be part of the investment club. Because <laughs> um, I don't have an actual um, vinyl for that. So I'm just using my membership one. Personal is going to have three categories. It is going to have... Home, which this is for home, 20, 10, 20, 30, which I'm not counting because if I know I have it here, I'm going to use it. A birthday fund, a self-care fund, which I have $10. So that's in my personal. I ordered um, dividers from Intentional Living, so I'm excited for those to come in before her shop closed. And then in miscellaneous... Um, I have one month ahead, which I kind of want to do that, but that's for a later date. I have a pet savings and a future medical. So what I'm going to do is every time I reach a 50 by the end of the month and I restuff on the 15th, uh, my plan is if I don't use this 50, I'm going to put 50 in here. Um, so fur baby, the 50 would go in the savings challenge and my medical 50 would go in the medical savings um and then i'll just start with what i have from the month so that will be 40 and 40 to also have some money in it but if i have extra money if i have more money than i need in my sinking funds i'll most likely use it and i don't want to do that i want to build this up so to put it in maybe my emergency fund um so yeah guys that's that so hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, please um, comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you in my next one. Bye.